students now in this session i will explain question number two uh, from e onwards okay that is uh, what is e e we are having 12 by 15 minus 7 by 15 as we see these two fractions are carrying the same denominator so it's become very easy for us so we'll make a common denominator now and we'll write the numerator with minus sign that is 12 minus 7 so 12 minus 7 is what 5 5 by 15 now we'll reduce it 5 1s are 5 5 threes are 15 so 1 upon 3 is the answer okay so let's move on to f 5 by 8 plus 3 by 8 again these two fractions are carrying the same denominator so we'll make it we'll write a common denominator like this 8 and we'll write the numerator with plus sign that is 5 plus 3 that would be 8 by 8 and 8 by 8 means what if you reduce this two number will 8 8 ones are 8 8 ones are 8 so answer is 1 okay now let's move on to sum number g now this sum number g this two fractions this is a number is there and one fraction is there and they are not carrying the same denominator so we, we have to make a common denominator or same denominator so if i have to put a three out here so what i have to do see i have to multiply this one with three by three that is with the numerator also because one is carrying one as a denominator also one is numerator and one as denominator also so this whole uh, this numerator and the denominator will be multiplied with 3 <coughs> and 3 okay that is 2 by 3 why we are doing this to make the denominator same so 3 1s is what 3 3 1s is what 3 minus 2 by 3 okay so we are making the denominator same so that we can make a common denominator it becomes easy so 3 so we will make a common denominator so this is a common denominator, uh, both the fractions are carrying the same denominator now. So we have written a common denominator now. We will write what? 3 minus 2, that is 1 upon 3. Okay. Let's move on to sum number H. 1 upon 4 minus 0 upon 4. So these two fractions are again carrying the same denominator. So make a common denominator 4, 1 minus 0. 1 minus 0 is what 1 by 4 so this is the answer 1 by 4 okay so let's move on to sum number i now sum number i again there is a number 3 so 3 is carrying denominator as 1 so you see 1 and 5 it's not matching so we have to make the denominator same for that what we have to do we have to multiply this 3 by 1 with 5 upon 5 understood minus 12 by 5 so 5 3 is what 15 5 ones are is what 5 minus 12 by 5 see now the denominators are same understood so this is a very easy way of doing it now <coughs> you know what exactly you have to do you have to make a common denominator so 15 minus 12 so what what will the answer answer would be 3 upon 5 <coughs> okay so that's it for today only five sums of question number two okay thank you and god bless you all